the shale revolution is one of America's greatest accomplishments. In just a few decades, U.S. industries pioneered the economical extraction of oil and gas from the pores of rock and made America the world's leading producer of energy today. According to one study, the shale revolution saves U.S. consumers $203 billion annually, or $2,500 for a family of four. American energy is more abundant and affordable than ever before. But some lawmakers want another energy revolution, one that would make energy increasingly scarce, costly, and unreliable. Through political mandates, draconian regulations, and trillion-dollar subsidies, they want to rapidly phase out the production and use of coal, oil, and natural gas, which supplies 80% of America's energy. Originally proposed in 2019, the Green New Deal has found new support among progressives in Washington. Just one component of the Green New Deal meeting 100% of U.S. power demand through renewable and zero emission sources, would cost ratepayers and taxpayers an estimated $490 billion annually. Another Green New Deal mandate for increased energy efficiency in buildings and homes would cost an estimated $42,000 per household. Implementing the Green New Deal energy agenda would cost the average household tens of thousands of dollars annually. Few Americans have any desire to incur such burdens for an unproven energy scheme. That may be why all senators who sponsored the Green New Deal voted present rather than yes when it came up for a vote. The shale revolution has made America the world's leading producer of oil and gas surpassing both Russia and Saudi Arabia. Costly centralized planning under the Green New Deal would take American energy back to the Dark Ages. There couldn't be a worse time to impose burdensome energy mandates on Americans still recovering from the pandemic. The Green New Deal is a recipe for economic disaster.